Um, so I've carried this PR over and made some um, improvements to it. Um, so I've introduced the concept of show tabs first. We, we all know about, or hopefully we all know about being able to use placement to move some of the fields into a tab um, in the admin area. Um, and I've now added the ability to move things into a card. Um, so you can have cards, content primary. Um, and I've also added this feature allowing us to move fields into columns. Um, so you're able to, like this is a very common kind of block that we would use quite regularly where we have a bit of content and we need a picture to go with it. Um, so in this case, I've called it a, a column aside media block. So it's got content beside it and then a piece of media. Um, but there's kind of no end of things you can do with it. You can take it too far. Um, I might have taken it a little bit too far on um, uh, one of the one of these ones here that I was experimenting with. I, I took it a little bit too far and they all end up getting quite crunched. Um, but yeah, this one got a little bit mad. Um, but it just allows you to kind of show a little bit more. Sorry? If you resize the screen, is it responsive? Um, yeah, so it's responsive. Um, what I've done is I've broken it um, at medium, so it'll, it should, oh, no, actually, I need to, need to change that. It should, when you go mobile, drop to just um, full, full width again. But I need to make a little change to that because I turned something off there. I was playing with it this afternoon. Um, so I should probably show you the kind of placement that you can actually use. If I find where I put that placement JSON file. So the normal tab modifier is is a hash. Um, the card modifier becomes a percentage sign, which is what we did for, for 01 as well. Uh, the column modifier is a pipe, like a column. Um, and then the column has a name, and it also has a, another modifier, which allows you to say how big you want that column to be. Uh, and then you can also positional the modifiers. Formalism that will be like bootstrap and grid like you could say uh, xs3 lg5 things like this so shorter prefix instead of media colon but you could pass multiple so you can then map it to bootstrap. well so the, the prefix is actually um, a grouping name um, which yes. says that all of these columns are going to go into a group <laughs> and then the post bit is is where you modify it with um, essentially anything you want. It's um, it just attaches it onto the end of the uh, okay. the column class. So you could use XS3. You can use X, you can use just three. Um, for most of these, you, you, it's probably going to want to collapse on a mobile view. So you're not. So it's, your default is going to be MD three. It's going to be three columns at, at medium, but it'll be twelve at um, when it's collapsed. Um, and one other thing that I did as well is um, the normal position modifier is the, the column sign here, which says that that media field is going to go first in the in the part section. Um, but you can also now, by using a semicolon, um, adjust the order of this grouping. Um, to say that the content tab is, or the content section is, is going to be in the middle, for example. Um, if I demonstrate that one, um, in this case, we've we've shifted the left tab first, the content block in the middle, and the right tab to the end. So that becomes a modifier that only applies to this section, as such. 
um, and that particular modifier is managed by the um, the zone groups, or the, the zone code rather than actually managed through placement info, um, as is as is this modifier because I didn't want to extend placement info too much. Um, so where this will work is where this works mostly is, is like it's not designed to work with the flow layout and there's another PR there from Mirage which which improves that as well um, which is looking great uh, but this is more about uh, content that is kind of standalone um, although you can put these blocks into a, the, these arrangements into a bag and you can still um, arrange your um, bag items in the same way, but inside the bag rather than on the, the outside of, of, of a flow part where you can change the sizes there. So it's more for people that are working with very specific designs um, where they want to represent that. It's good. Okay.